The boots I'm about to show you are most likely the best boots for the outdoors that you'll ever see. Don't get caught in the trap of thinking and being normal. Throughout my life, I've found that if most people are doing something, often better to go in a different direction. These boots in particular are gum leaf Saxons. These boots are made from real rubber, not fake synthetic material that most rubber boots are made out of from big box store companies. I hate to break it to you, but the boots you're currently wearing, the rubber boots that you currently own, are most likely not real rubber. And that may come as a big surprise to you. It did for me as well a couple of years ago when I found out that these big box store, these really popular brands, are selling people boots made from fake plastic synthetic material. Here are three facts that I'm going to tell you about the Gumleaf USA brand. Fact number one, Gumleaf USA boots are made by hand in Europe. They're built for comfort. They've got a stitched in insole that a lot of other boot companies don't have. If you've ever pulled your foot out of your boot and the insole came with it because it's a cheap floppy piece of whatever they use, that's no good. You want one that's stitched inside the boot. And then the third and final thing that I really want you to know about this boot is a bit of simple math. Math in that, if you buy a good pair of boots like Gumleaf USA, you're not gonna need another pair, at least for a very, very long time. If you're a person who's constantly going out and buying new pair of rubber boots, the mainstream rubber boot companies, and you have to replace those all the time, that's no good. You end up spending a lot more money than you would if you just bought one good pair of natural rubber boots from Gumleaf USA. If you currently own a pair of rubber boots from the mainstream brands, you're very lucky if they haven't leaked yet. Either that, or you just don't use them very often. A friend of mine a while ago purchased one of the more popular brands of the mainstream boot brands you're gonna find at big box stores. He's not even an outdoorsman, he just wears these rubber boots every now and then in rainy conditions. He came over one time and we crossed a creek and immediately those boots leaked. Years ago, I purchased two popular brands of rubber boots and the same thing happened to me. What happened was it leaked where the rubber touches the neoprene, where the rubber meets the neoprene on the boot. And that's kind of an issue because there should be rubber all the way up the boot rather than just being rubber turning into neoprene. So with the two boots that I had, the two different brands, completely separate brands, and the brand that my buddy had, we've got three brands that are very popular. You can find them almost anywhere. Those boots leak because they're not using real natural organic rubber found from trees and the problem with those is that they're fake synthetic and they consist up to 85% fake synthetic material. When I first heard about the fact that the boots I was using years ago could be fake and that these rubber boot companies were selling plastics and other fillers inside their boots, I was kind of in denial. I was like, there's no way. That's just a marketing scheme. That's impossible. They don't do that. And I looked into it for myself and I found out they were absolutely right. There are very few companies nowadays that sell actual rubber boots that you can depend on. If you're a well-rounded outdoorsman like me and you hunt and fish, you know that having boots and your footwear is extremely important. If you're really just a hunter, the most important thing you take into the woods with you would be your weapon, bow, shotgun, rifle, whatever. However, if you've got bad boots on, that's gonna ruin your hunt. I would argue that the second most important item you take with you in the woods for any hunting experience is your footwear. If your feet get cold, if your boots leak, your hunt in most cases is over, especially in colder climates. If you live in North America, you need to make sure you visit the website gumleafusa.com. If you go to gumleaf.com, it's probably going to lead you to a different website, that of which you cannot order from. So if you're from North America, you want to go to gumleafusa.com to get to the correct website, and they can help you out there. It's a great website with lots of comprehensive information. It's very clear. The information on the website explains exactly what you need, how to take care of your boots, even to teach you how to put on your boots, and so much more. Also in the description, I'm going to show you the user manual that you can easily reference if you want to learn more about these boots and how to take care of them because that's a big factor. Over the years, I've had a lot of conversations with the older generations, either the generation my parents' age or my grandparents' age. They told me that when their rubber boots or hip boots or waders would leak or crack or have an issue, they could take them to the local tire shop to be repaired. Now, with most of the boots that they sell today that they call rubber, you can't take those to the local tire shop to be replaced. So the boots that I currently have are called the Gumleaf Saxons. And the reason why I chose these is because they do come with neoprene on the inside of the boot. These neoprene boots really help me stay warm in the cold months, especially leading up to 
the end of October, November, and even into December. On GumleafUSA.com, there are no temperature specifications for their boots, and they do this for good reason. It also depends on your hunting style. For example, are you driving deer? Are you still hunting deer? Are you sitting for three hours to hunt deer? Are you hunting early season, peak rut, late season? What state are you hunting in? There's all kinds of factors that go into play here when it comes to picking out the right boots for you. You're gonna find these boots that are gonna be super practical from gumleafusa.com for all of those purposes. I don't have boots just for deer hunting. I don't have boots just for fishing in rainy conditions, especially when it's cold out. I don't do that. I use these boots for everything. So if you're watching this and you're saying, well, Corey, I don't really deer hunt at all, but I want really good high quality rubber boots. Fine, then don't use them for deer hunting. Use them for the situation that suits your life and your needs at the time. Rubber boots are not just for the outdoorsman. I use them all the time working around the house. They're great for farming and general outdoor work. So if you don't hunt or fish throughout the year like I do, these high quality rubber boots will be great for other priorities as well. You're not going to be disappointed with these boots. They're gonna help you in all of those different situations. If you've been watching this channel for quite some time now, you know that I'm not super brand specific because I believe that going out to the woods or on the water requires your brain as your number one tool, not the gear and all the stuff you take with. If I am talking about certain brands on this channel, it's because I believe in them. I get contacted by companies periodically asking me to review, be a salesman for their company on my YouTube channel. And I turn down about 95% of those companies. I'm just not interested in promoting other companies' products for them if I don't believe in it or even if I've never even used their product before. That if I'm promoting a product on my channel, it is a guarantee that it's gonna work well for you. If I find something that I love that I know is gonna work well and benefit my viewers, that's what this channel is about, so benefiting the people that watch it, I'm gonna talk about it, I'm going to promote it. And when you purchase real rubber boots, like from Gumleaf USA, the boots that I have and the boots I would suggest you at least look into and consider buying, you need to take care of them because real rubber can crack, it can dry out, but it won't do that if you take care of it properly. If you don't take care of them, they're going to crack, they're not going to last as long, but it's very easy to do with a simple product you can order at the time of purchasing the Gumleaf boots from the Gumleaf USA website. Check this out. There's a company called Grangers and they make a rubber boot care product that you can spray on your boots after you purchase them and after you've used them for a while. Gumleaf USA recommends using Grangers rubber boot care about three times a year, but it really depends on how often you use your boots. If you don't have this product, make sure you buy some online or go to a local store and get some. Think of these boots as an investment and you need to protect your investment. If you'd like to learn more about Gumleaf USA boots, go to gumleafusa.com and check out their website. It's gonna be very beneficial to you. Any questions, put down in the comments below. More than happy to answer those questions for you to the best of my ability. I get back to all my viewers within 24 hours. So make sure you ask down below. Thanks.